The Senate has amended the Electoral Act 2022 to allow statutory delegates to participate and vote in political parties' conventions, congresses and meetings. This followed the passage of the amended bill on the act at the Committee of the Whole, which was sponsored by Deputy Senate President Ovie Omoagege. Presenting the bill, Omoagege said that it sought to amend the provision of Section 84, Subsection 8 of the Electoral Act, which, according to him, does not provide for the participation of what is generally known as statutory delegates in the conventions, congresses, or meetings of political parties. This error, which led to us coming back to look at the correction, was something that happened inadvertently. I don't think it was the intentment of this hallowed chamber, neither was it the intentment of those who perfected the document to send to Mr. President. But I believe in the course of a work like this, things like this are bound to happen. And I think this one is no less one of them. And that is why we are trying to do this amendment to ensure that what the political parties are known to do by allowing statutory delegates in addition to the delegates that will be elected by the various political parties constitute the electoral college for all the elections that we talk about. To have the privilege of leading the debate on this very important bill, we seek to amend the Electoral Act 2022 to make provision for delegates who have not been elected ad hoc delegates as prescribed in the constitution of a political party and the Electoral Act to participate in the convention, congress or meeting of the party. Mr. President, this bill was read for the first time on the floor of the Senate today, Tuesday, the 10th day of May 2022. Mr. President, distinguished colleagues, the issue here is narrow and very straightforward. Mr. President, as couched, Section 84, Subsection 8 of the Electoral Act 2022 does not provide for the participation of what is generally known as statutory delegates in the conventions, congresses, or meetings of political parties. A bill for an act to amend the Electoral Act 2022 and for other matters connected there to 2022 third reading taken. And the bill is passed. Uh, thank you very much, uh, distinguished colleagues. Let me explain a little bit what we have done. The Electoral Act of 2022, or the amended uh, Electoral Act of 2022 that we passed this year, has a deficiency that was never intended and that deficiency will deny all statutory delegates in all political parties from participation in congresses and conventions. And therefore, such a major, such an unintended clause has to be amended before the party primary start in the next eight days. So this is an emergency effort to ensure that nobody is denied his or rightful opportunity as a delegate. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.